everyone, it's Melody with Design by Melody. I have a haul for you today. I have a couple different things from a couple different places. A few things that I purchased online and a few things I picked up at my local Michaels. So I'm going to go through everything with you and I'll share each one individually. So let's start with the Michaels purchases. So I went to my, lo Oops. So I went to my local Michaels. I'm going to take this off. All right. So I went to my local Michaels and I picked up a couple different things. I picked up this Project Life um, kit. It is their smaller kits that have 180 pieces in it. There are, let's see if it says, there are 64 by 6 cards, 30 different designs, so two of each of those. And there's 120 3 by 4 cards, 40 different designs, so there's three of each of those. Excuse me, three of each of those, and they're all double-sided. And this is the Baby Boy collection. They had a girl collection there as well. These were on clearance, I think, for $6.99, something like that. So I went ahead and picked it up. I have never done a baby album for my son because I wasn't scrapbooking yet whenever he was born. Um, but I do plan at some point to do that. Now, I already took these out of the little cellophane packages, so you have to excuse the fact that they're kind of all over the place. But I will share them with you. I'm just going to quickly flip through here. As I mentioned, there are two of each of these designs. Now, I really like that these have the blues, the two different tones, or three different tones, really, of blues, and then the greens, and then they have, the, of course, the whites. Um, I also like the fact that a lot of these are pretty versatile. You don't necessarily have to use them for a baby boy. You can use a lot of these for beach-themed uh, projects actually because a lot of them actually have the anchors on them. I don't exactly get why the anchors are in here but it's okay. And like this one, this could be used for anything that's not baby related. I'm just going to flip through here. I also really like the grays and there's a couple birthday hats as well. Clouds. I might actually, if they still have it, check out the baby girl set because if there's as many versatile cards in there as there is in this one it would be worth having it. I still don't understand the life-saving rafts and the anchors that really makes no sense to me but whatever. Right, there's a lot of journaling ones in here which I really like so you kinda get the idea I'm going to keep flipping just so you can see. A lot of these you can also use vertical or horizontal because they're not necessarily um, one directional. Now, a lot of them do have journaling lines, but you could very easily use this as a vertical card and, and put a, a piece of blank paper over that and write your journaling the opposite direction if you would like. And a lot of these banners can go either direction, especially on the cards that are grid. All right, so we're almost to the end of the 4 by 6 cards here. Again, I think this is a really cute set, especially like that bright colors. All right, so those are the 4 by 6 cards. Then you get all your 3 by 4 cards. Let's pull these out. Oops. Didn't work out so well. Okay. <clears throat> I really like this card. It says you are so loved, but it's the navy and the white. And I really like this card too. There are three of each of these. Now tell me if you guys like these Project Life flip throughs. I probably will start purchasing more core kits because I'm using them a lot. And I thought about um, it'd be nice to like sell a fourth of it or get rid of a fourth of it but honestly I just can't be bothered with with figuring out how to swap or do those type of things so I thought about maybe doing a giveaway whenever I buy a core kit and give away a fourth of the kit because I don't know that I would ever use an entire core kit if I committed to just using one for an entire year of Project Life, I probably could, but I don't see myself ever doing that because I like buying scrapbooking kits and um, using those. So I really don't know that I would ever be able to just buy one core kit and use it to, to completion. So I thought about doing 
like a giveaway, but let me know if that's something that any of you guys would be interested in. I like that. A story to remember with the date. <clears throat> this one doesn't have enough cards really for me to do a giveaway with, but like a, an entire core kit definitely would. I really like these cards. This is obviously boy themed with the greens and the blues, but it's not overly so. No, oh, that's cute with the little socks. I have a lot of pictures of Kaylin's feet whenever he was little. Actually, one of his newborn pictures is just kind of his butt and feet. I really like the grays, the really pale gray that's been mixed in here. I'm a sucker for gray and then a bright color. I think gray actually may be one of my favorite colors to scrap up with. That's cute. This is a brighter anchor. See? Alright, we are down to the last few here. And that's it. So that's a really cute set. It's older. It's not brand new by any means. Um, I don't know if it says the year. Just, I'm making all kinds of noises. Uh, 2014, so it's not incredibly old, but it is a couple years old. So that is that kit. It's on clearance at Michael's, at least at my local Michael's, if it's something you're looking for. It's, it was a pretty good buy, I thought, anyways. So there is that one. And I don't keep them in these packaging. I just have it in there right now in order for me to show you all. Then I had two sets of washi tapes. Now these are already out of their packages because I have used them in my planner. Um, there are these three that are kind of teal and navy blue and then there's these three that are black and white. And I was looking for some thin washi. Now there is a washi that is thinner because I believe this is uh, three eighths of an inch is probably what I would say this is. Yeah, not exactly a half inch but bigger than a quarter inch. So um, these are really nice to use for that and those are the reasons I bought those. Now they were $4.99 each but I used 40% off coupon at each one of those because I went to Michael's two different times. Now this is the other thing I purchased and they have their little paper packs. Um, usually it's over by the pad, like the, the um, pads of pattern paper. Uh, and they had all their paper packs. Normally I think they're either $3.99 or $4.99, but they had all of them, every single one of them, clearance to $1.99. And so I picked up the Dear Lizzie Serendipity um, set. I never purchased this. Now these seem to be the thinner papers, but I'm okay with that. For $1.99 getting 12, or 12 pattern papers that are double-sided, I'm cool with that, especially with the colors that these are. So there are two of each of these, so I'll just flip through here so you can see them. I really like this teal, so you know I'll be using that. really like the words here and this triangle print is really cute and I do plan on taking one of these pattern papers and cutting apart the cameras because I use it however I really like this side as well so I don't know we'll see and then there is a cut apart sheet with an ombre pink on the back and then the second page of each of those so for $1.99 that was fairly a good deal I thought and whenever I take my papers out of the package at least while I still have most of the kit. I just keep the little heading sheet and then I clip it together and I put it in my little box of papers. Alright, then I purchased a few things online. I purchased from two different planning planner sticker girls. Um, this one is from Penguin Prints Company and you can find these on Etsy. These are Etsy shops. I purchased her smaller st sets of each of her stickers. I got these little meal planning ones, which I really like. I think these are so cute. They're tiny, tiny. Um, they're just a spoon and a fork. I'll see if you can see that. hope you can see that. Um, then there are these birthday presents. There's these appointment stickers, which are really cute. There are these little dumbbells for workouts. There's a stethoscope for doctor's appointments. And then there's these little reminder scallop stickers. Now, I did go ahead and use some of these in my planner video. And I will say, even though these little scallop reminder stickers are incredibly cute, it's a tiny, tiny space to write. So I probably would maybe purchase something a little larger on that one. But those are penguin prints. Oops. And then I got these from Planner Kate. And Planner Kate included a little freebie with it which just has some icons and some labels which I thought was really cute 
And a lot of her stuff that I purchased, I only purchased three things, but I believe two of them were on sale. I just wanted to kind of get a feel for her products. And that's the same thing I did with Penguin Prints. I wanted to get a feel for their products, just to see the quality and the shipping and customer service and all. Um, so here's Planner Kate. These are really cute. These are just your little labels. I love the little checklist. Uh, like radio button icons and then I got her her sampler pack and this is to go along with her kit if you were to purchase her monthly kit now I don't have an Erin Condren and these are set up for an Erin Condren but a lot of these things are really versatile the only one I probably wouldn't use would be the weekend but then again in my happy planner I could use the weekend starting the weekend so I mean I'm not not going to use it but I probably it's not really ideal for me to buy the ones that have the weekend banner just because I don't typically use those. But we'll see. You never know. Then I purchased from Ellie's Studio. And she gave me, oops, that's not here. She gave me two freebies here. I purchased the Love You More Little Snippets labels. And I will cut all of these apart and put them in my little Ellie's Studio box. Then I bought the Love You More Little Snippets True Love, and I already had this one, but I like it, and I think it was extremely clearanced out. There are these Everyday Moments cutouts. These are the, there are 12 tags here. And then the Love You More cutouts, and these again are 12 tags. So these three are from the same collection. This is a different one, but, and she gave me two of these, so I have a freebie here, which I really like. And then she also gave me a January 2016 card as a freebie. It has Fresh Start on the back. Now, I purchased the 2015 cards, and I love them, <laughs> except for I forgot to use it in my September title page for my September 2015 spread. However, I may use it in one of the pockets on the, um, on the facing page. I haven't done that yet. I'll have to remember to pull that out. And then I got the Love You More journaling tags, and there are 12 in here. And these are the like Project Life cards. So let me show you what comes in here. Oops. And I believe some of these are sold out now. I purchased these hmm, probably two weeks ago. And I, okay, so just a word of what I do. <laughs> I keep these and I cut these apart and I use them as small little tags. All right, I've got the Oh So Lovely. I want to spend forever with you. That's really cute with the scallop. Oh, that's cute. A little heart. That would be really pretty for Valentine's Day. Um, just a striped card. Now, none of these are, are, are um, double-sided, just so you know. A little heart. Some scallops, and it says, I treasure this. This would be a really cute journaling card. Um, some hearts. Date and note. One in a million, that's cute. XOXO, some arrows with a heart, and then my favorite. So that is everything I got from Ellie's studio. Um, <laughs> I got all this and I, I literally spent less than like $4. So you can't beat that. I always pay attention whenever she has things on sale or on clearance. And um, I also look for any grab bags that she has. They're completely worth it, completely. So, anyways, those are my Ellie Studio purchases. I'm like number one fan of Ellie Studio, so I can never say enough positive things. And then I purchased um, from Studio 29 Designs, and it's Sarah Mitchell. And it's um, www.thestudio29designs.com. This is my first time purchasing from her, but I'm extremely excited. Whenever I started looking at her planner stamps, I knew I had to have them. So I went ahead and purchased two. I just got two small ones. And I got the school themed one. Let me take this out. I just want to make sure you can see it. There we go. Oh, now you really can't see it. Aha, here we go. Okay. So it has a little, yeah, it has a little notepad, like um, notebook paper, routine goals, and, and these are all separate. Supplies, field trip, back to school, PTSO. Important class party, appreciation day, PTO, parent meeting, teacher, volunteer, PTA, study, after school, extracurricular, holiday, spring, fall, break, winter, no school, assignment, open house, schedule, packed lunch, gym, hot lunch, don't forget, early release, homework, and you've got a book bag, a pencil, a lunchbox, and a book. So this is so cute. 
and these are the perfect size. They're tiny. It's the perfect size for my planner. And then I got the sports set. And this one I'm extremely excited about because I think this is freaking adorable. So Kaylin was sitting there looking at it, telling me what all the sports were. But you've got basketball um, all the way down to ice skating and roller skating, all the way down to bicycling and golf and canoeing and swimming and boxing and billiards and skateboarding and <laughs> running and a kettlebell and <laughs> like a clinic or a, a medic. You've got vitamins, you've got a measuring tape, you've got a scale, and you've got like an apple. So, I mean, there is a ton of stuff on here. It's extremely cute. It's very versatile. You can use it for a lot of different things, and I'm really excited about that one as well. So those are the two stamp sets I got from Studio 29 Designs. And then I also picked up the Imaginese um, die-cut cardstock shapes. And I'm trying to remember what collection this is. Uh, of course I can't remember what it is. But it's really cute. Um, it's got a bicycle, a moped. It's got lots of tags and hearts. It's got a stop sign. I think it's travel. Actually, I think it is travel. There's a globe, some geotags, some road signs, suitcases, cameras, um, mail, like postcards, tags. There's a lot of really cute things in here, so that's going to be extremely cute to use, too. And then I picked up her two grab bags, I believe. I don't actually have my receipt with me. I did buy this Tell Your Story. I think it was like a quarter, so I went ahead and picked that up. And then I believe these are the two grab bags. I'm not 100% sure, but um, <clears throat> take a look at her website. You'll be able to see it. There are just these 3 by 4 cards, and some of them are double-sided and some of them are not. But this is like a sketchy flower. <laughs> these look like lollipops to me, but it's like a swirl. Polka dot. Hello, November. So yeah, I'm pretty sure this is the grab bag because it's got miscellaneous cards in here. Um, a scallop, and then it's got an F on the back. Some arrows. Now these I actually might cut apart and use separately. Wonder, and wonder in a different color. Stay curious. Um, it's kind of like, so I think it is, it's kind of like a bokeh pattern, but it's, um, I think it's like Christmas ornaments in the background. And then that one, which reminds me of Christmas lights. And then Hello Summer. So those are the 3x4 cards, and then there are a few 4x6 cards as well. I'm extremely excited to use these. This is the first time I've purchased from Studio 29 Designs. Uh, there are all these little emoticons. This matches that 3x4 card. That also matches it in color. It's like a chevron. Now a little arrow with some yellow scallops. Oh, I like that one. Actually, I actually like that one better. This one. Some planes, that'd be really good for a travel layout. And then go where the heart leads you. That's a really nice filler card, or a title card. So anyway, so that's everything I purchased for this haul. Keep an eye out, because I believe I have a few more things coming in the mail. I'm not 100% sure, but for some reason I feel like I ordered something else that I don't have yet. <clears throat> We've had some crazy weather here recently, so everything's delayed in shipping. But thanks for joining me today, guys. Keep an eye out for what I create with all of these wonderful goodies. All right, bye guys, thanks.